Well, hi guys. Wanted to do a really quick uh, Windows 7 tip, um, and that is adding copy to folder and move to folder within your right click context menu. So here I have a file right on my desktop. I could copy to or move to any folder anywhere else and it's the regular uh, user interface for Windows it's nothing uh, out of the ordinary there um, this does involve some registry tweaks and I could open it up and show all of it to you but it would be it would take a lot of time and it'd be confusing to most people honestly the best way I can tell you to, to do it is go to www.7forums.com go to their tutorial section I want to give all the credit to this uh, to Brink an administrator over there at 7forums.com I've been uh, involved with this forum for uh, about a year now they're the greatest bunch of guys you'll ever know and you don't need to worry about viruses or any of that kind of crap on here so to add to the context menu you just click the download save that download to your desktop unzip it there'll be a .reg file in there you'll just want to right click that reg file and click merge it'll give you a warning then a confirmation just go ahead and press yes on the warning ok on the confirmation you'll be set at the same time, you may want to download the remove from the context menu zip file. Just uh, save both those folders in the same place with your drivers or somewhere in a folder in case you ever want to remove and undo the changes. Honestly, I don't think you're going to want to do it. It's a very, very useful feature. I use it all the time and it's really, really handy to pretty much have anything you click on be able to copy or move to um, anywhere else on the computer. So that's been the Windows 7 tip for the day and uh, you guys have a great day. We'll talk to you soon.